She's wearing a dress. I love wearing dresses. Hello everyone, I hope you guys are having a great day. I'm so happy that you chose one of my videos to watch with me today and I hope you guys subscribe and stay. That would make my little heart really happy, but anyways. So I had never heard anything about the show. There's this girl that does commentaries just like I do. Uh, I don't want to mispronounce her name, but here it is. It's like S S Sophia. I really don't want to mess that up, so I'm sorry if I butchered that. But go ahead and check out her channel. She makes commentaries just like I do and they're awesome. But she started watching The Artful Dodger and before I even started watching her video, I was like, you know what? I think I want to watch this. This like I watched like a couple seconds. I was like, oh, this looks interesting. I want to watch it with you guys for the first time. So I paused. I stopped watching and we're filming our own. But before we get into this video, I would love to remind you guys that we are currently on a goal of trying to hit a thousand subscribers because when we do, I have a really fun video just for you guys, but I can only release it when we hit a thousand sub subscribers. Sub -bus -sub -bus -sub subscribers. So make sure to subscribe and give this video a like while you're at it. If you have any interesting movies or shows that you think I would get a kick out of that we could laugh together, we can make jokes about it together make sure to let me know and let's just get right into this video guys i'm so excited it just looks really interesting from like the first couple seconds that i watch Ooh, there's a rat we're playing poker and we're on a boat. And Newt from uh, The Maze Runner is on the show. Oh, by the way, guys, I know that I never finished the last Maze Runner movie. The problem was I filmed the whole video and I wasn't happy with it because the content that I put out for you guys, I want it to be good. Even if I spend hours filming something, if I don't think that it's actually good, I'm not gonna upload it. I didn't like the video and I didn't wanna refilm a whole video and pretend to have reactions when like they weren't authentic. Let me know if you guys would like to see me watch the last movie anyway, even though I've already seen it and just like I could talking about it instead of having like a first time <gasps> oh my god you know but let me know what are we doing everyone's yelling cut why are we yelling cut and what time period is this placed a bunch of money what are you gonna do about it wait huh someone's on the table and they're screaming cut i'm so confused what's going on i don't understand do you even earn that in a year he has to pay up something did he just win i don't understand poker at all <laughs> I wish I did. <gasps> He's a cheater! You're cheating. He just got punched in the face for calling out the guy for uh, cheating! How did he get punched in the face? And I was bleeding! I can get you the money. Oh, that's a beautiful ship. He's running because he's trying to get them the money. The question is, can he actually get them the money? We don't, I don't even know how much money he is. Why do they look like mad at him? Or not mad, mad's the wrong word, but like, uh, what's the word when someone looks at you like, oh no, what did you do now? What's that word? Is he gonna cut this person? I'm so confused. The Royal Hospital somewhat proudly presents Dr. Rain's Oh wait, are they doing surgery on this guy's leg? Cause his leg looks like really cut up and bloody. Leg but isn't it shattered. weird that like, they're, they're watching it? They're watching a surgery, I'm so is who cuts in my opinion the surgeon should cut but i don't know what kind of show this is so me all right we don't even know your name yet dr sneed here seems to think that i can't amputate this leg in less than his record of 43 seconds 43 seconds to amputate a leg that cannot be healthy there's probably diseases this will be the worst 30 seconds of your life i mean are they doing it for the greater Good. His leg is infected or like, or he got bitten or something. Like you never know. Oh, that must be so painful. <laughs> They're not gonna like show this, are they? I mean, I watch Grey's Anatomy, so I'll, I'll be fine. If they go into detail, I'll hide it from you guys. For those of you that can't stomach it. Okay, they show it in the tiniest bit. Like not really. Is he gonna manage in 40, 30 seconds? Time. 28 seconds. 28 seconds. A lucky cut. Congratulations, bro. And he didn't even get any money for it. Oh, and he's supposed to pay the other guy. So I don't know what he's gonna do with that. Patient Lady Bell. So he's a doctor on top of being a poker player? Completely focused on whatever hair brings. Girl, why are you wearing that? What? Oh my God, I dude, wait. I'm sorry guys, I'm literally watching the Fosters right now. I love this girl so much. For some reason, I can't remember her real name. I'm thinking of Callie Foster, the character. What's her name? My Maya, Maya Mitchell. Something like that. You stormed in on me. Oh, I'm so happy she's in the show. What? I didn't know this. You can give the patient ether and they don't feel a thing. That's crazy. Oh yeah, they don't have anesthesia. Anesthesia. Anesthesia, yet. The Honorable Mortimer Smales. He just sailed four months from England. Who is, is this gonna be new? The guy, like we don't, we don't know his actual name yet. I'm far too busy to meet anybody called Mortimer. Is his name Mortimer? Mortimer? <laughs> 
<laughs> I'm gonna butcher that accent. What was wrong with the last one? Sir Jeremy Glasscock. Are you listening to the name? You know perfectly well I can't marry till you do. Wait, are they sisters? Go and marry the Honorable Snail. Oh, right, so I can't tell their relationship while you're other sisters or not. I don't... She can't get married until she gets married, so I feel like that has to be something. Something sisterly over there. Wait, before we continue the show, I want to understand a little bit more. In 1850s Australia, 15 years after the events of Oliver Twist, Jack Daw Dawkins, that's so close to Dawson's, fast returns to haunt him as he moves back to the world of crime after leaving behind pickpocketing to become a surgeon. I kind of understand a little bit, but I still don't understand a lot, and that's good because I want to be, like, confused. I like learning as I'm watching. I love the vibes. How's that squawker, Mrs. Wellings? Lately, I've been obsessed with the, not necessarily the, these outfits or these vibes, but uh, like Cirilla from The Witcher or a Game of Thrones, those type of hairstyles. I really want to start doing them just because I think they're so pretty. I also love the outfits, but girl, where, where can I get that? You see, I I'll tell you what, why don't you come see at the hospital? Did he just like run away from possibly being caught? Mans is a runner. May is runner! <laughs> I'm kidding. What are we watching? Who's Charlie there? His friend? His brother? I know why I have an accent. Oh, okay, they're gonna unalive somebody. I think it is so weird that people just gathered and just watched them do this. Why'd he punch him? Don't feel comfortable doing this, Dr. Jack. So he's Dr. Jack, but why'd he punch him in the face? I'm so confused. Why is he being like, he's like, I'm sorry. Blah. Oh, so he pushed him down so that they could catch him. 26 pounds by next Monday, Friday, Tuesday. So he owes money? And it's, I, get, I don't know who that guy is, but that guy punched him out again. So thrilled I might pop. I thought you said I might poop. And I was like, girl, I get you. <laughs> who is this? Lady. <coughs> thought he was like in a vomit or something. She's Lady Bell. Sweet lady. I'm uncomfy and I'm sure that she's uncomfortable too because this is weird. It's really weird to pull out a letter in front of a stranger and just start reading like that. Did you know, Mr. Smales, the human bow is 15 feet long? That is really fun fact. That is, I love her. She's so cool. <laughs> I mean, perfect. She wanted to send him away. Chain gang. He looks so familiar, but for some reason, why am I having trouble pinpointing his face? Cheer up, Dawkins. You look like you've swallowed a lemon. Maybe he did swallow a lemon. Bruh. What if we don't judge him, okay? I, st I stole clothes for me, baby, but he died on the way over. Well, that's really messed up. What the? She can help the school, Mom. I can't read. It's all right. They'll teach you. Oh, he's protecting that girl because that girl is... I don't, I don't know if they're, like, reaching out. I, I don't know if they're interviewing prisoners. I don't understand what's going on, but she stole clothes for her baby, and then her baby passed away on the way over here, and then Jack was like, you know what? Here's a teaching job, and I think that's really sweet. And even though she can't read, they'll teach her. It's just crazy to me. Why is he looking all concerned? Hello, Dodge. The artful Dodger. Is Jack supposed to be this like huge Dodger? Like he dodges payments and things like that? <laughs> oh, that's interesting. I feel like him pulling the guy to the side is a little suspicious now. He's flabbergasted. He's like, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> what are you doing here? You're dead. Uh, uh, apparently he's not dead. They you 15 years ago. Wait, is this the guy that we watched get hit on a live? There's no way. I was a Navy surgeon. You done well for yourself. Who are you? Oh, his name's Fagin. Fagin. I imagine what this man is going through. Up until now, he's like, this man's been dead. Uh, like, this man's gone. I, I watched him be gone. And then suddenly he's in front of his face? That's traumatizing. One word gets out about our past. Ooh, okay, he's threatening him. To even think it hurts. I don't think that's a good thing. He's saying, I'm here for you just as you're here for me, but I don't think that's a good thing. I feel like he can use it against you and things will get very messy over here. Did they escape convicts here? He escaped from prison? Well, I'll take that as he is. Wait, he was in prison in London and now, so it, now they're set in Australia? Is that what it's supposed to be? I'll give you one, just keep me off that chain gang. Ooh, that's really messed up. I need another on the chain gang. No, I was thinking of making my convict seven. All right. I don't know how this is gonna go. Man smells like a Yorkshire pig house. Yeah, let him have a bath and a change of clothes, because that's, I'm sure he smells nasty. <laughs> I mean, who knows when the last time he even showered? Pick up my bag. Why? Because you're a servant. Dodge! Does it come to this? You also have to stop calling him Dodge. I feel like that's gonna, like, make people think, why is he calling him Dodge? And question it. Yeah, you don't wanna do that. You'll need to look less syphilitic scarecrow. 
Why are you so scratchy? Because you left me in a cell as a boy alone in the cold? Wait, so this isn't the guy that we saw get unalive before. This is something else. They have like a history. I mean, obviously they had a history that's kind of obvious with what's going on, but hmm. I said you'd escaped in a snowstorm, no shoes. So I don't blame the man because if he heard that the kid escaped and it's literally, if he came back for the kid and he was told that the kid escaped and it was cold to the point that he wouldn't survive, I wouldn't question that because he, he tried to come back for you, but you escaped. <laughs> like he thought you were gone. Because the worst I done is I left my beautiful boy. I left my beautiful boy. Who is this for him? Oliver Twist saved me at the last second with a reprieve. But ever since I rescued you from outside that pub. He rescued him as a baby? So is he supposed to be like a father figure or something? Since then I have loved you in my own odd way. Hmm, okay, their history is interesting. If what he's saying is even true, because we don't know that. <laughs> and a job. But only because I am a doctor. I feel like that's nice of him. He'll give him a roof and a job. That's a lot more than a lot of people are asking from there. Yeah, he's got a nice old place here. You shall sleep here. Understood? How do they How shower? shower? How did you get here? Captain Grimm. Captain Grimm gave him a future? Who's Captain Grimm? He liked my quick fingers. He saw the mess you'd left me and decided to help me escape. That's nice. Oh, your good fortune's all down. So this Captain Grimm guy gave him this life, basically? Pickpocketing. How do you think you got those quick fingers? I mean, that's a, an interesting way of looking at it. <laughs> I don't think that that's very proper. What a father does. So is he supposed to be like his father? <laughs> I mean, to be fair though, if he rescued you from a pub and yeah, he taught you pickpocketing, yeah, it's like, it's not good. <laughs> Look at that. At the end of the day, I feel like he is the closest thing he might have to a father figure. Not the happy dodge I knew. That's kind of sad, but at the same time, I mean, look at what he's been through. If he used to be a pickpocketer that was in prison, he escaped prison, now he's a surgeon. I have a 26 pound debt on my head. And that. Cannot forget about that. And if I don't pay it, I get my hand chopped off. So how are we getting the money? Does he have the money? Is he gonna sell that? I am an officer. Former. A gentleman. Sort of. And a surgeon. <laughs> that was funny. Doctor? We need you in the surgery now. Okay, so now he has to go do a surgery because the professor is drunk and he's gonna trim his beard in the meantime. Oh. Wait, is it his leg? Today we perform Hunter's procedure for a popliteal aneurysm. Popliteal aneurysm. He ate the artery, and if it bursts, he dies. That, you don't tell uh, the patient that right before you're about to cut open his leg. Oh, he might die, but maybe not. Bro, you're drunk as hell. Step back and let let Jack do it. This is not a good no. Scalpel. Why is he giving him the scalpel? Not that one, sir. Higher step. Why? 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 Why are they letting him do it? Why are they letting him do it? He's drunk, and now the blood squirted all over his glasses, and he can't see anything. Dude, did he just blow his artery? I'm not sure what else you can do once you've done that. I feel like it's. Two, one, exsanguinate. Exsanguinate? What? Shouldn't have interfered, Dawkins. Interfered? The guy was drunk. No, he did the right thing. He was trying to save him. Surely there must be somebody more competent. Oh my god, her, her daughter. But Dawkins just isn't up to scratch. I feel like give her this girl a chance. The most brilliant young surgeon in the Royal Navy. I feel like she has something to say about it, but she doesn't say anything. Or is it like not respected if she speaks upon it? Well, I, I think we might continue this little experiment for a while longer. Okay, so they're letting Jack continue being a surgeon. Yes, this one stole a chicken. I'll see my husband gets them. Okay, so she a nicer lady because... He just gave her a bunch of uh, death warrants, but she was like, mm, I don't know if this, like, I don't know if all these death warrants even make sense because all this girl was trying to do is steal a chicken. Like one of the criminals. So maybe this lady's good and he doesn't like that. There's a lot of blood. Where are we? A lot of blood. A, a lot. A lot of blood. 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 Blood? I have a problem with the English accent. <laughs> So this is a flashback of when he shoved him into the cell and left him there. For 15 years. How did he get out? Fagan, I knew you wouldn't leave me. Aw, he did end up coming back. We blamed for a murder that I definitely did. Is this the last time that he sees him? The gang won't be the same without you. The gang? Is, is he a part of a gang? Like they're all pickpocketers or something? Or was that just a figure of speech? I do feel bad about this. I don't know how much that helps. I, I get it, but I, I don't know how much that helps by saying it in that moment. Would you like to play the harp for me, Lady Bell? No. She is not interested. I'm sorry. Is she, it seems that she just wants to be a surgeon. She seems really cool. Anyway, I had a book of poetry published. Several times. Yeah, if she's reading a book and continuously not listening to what you're saying, she is not interested. Where are you going? Insufferable bull. She's not interested. Come, 
We're going to see the hospital. Oh, so now she's suddenly interested because he has family, like... So she's using this to her advantage to get into the hospital and learn more, I guess. That's interesting. Made this from a nice little bit of diamond. I mean, that's pretty interesting that they figured out something for him. Ew, the cat's... Ew, that's yucky. The cat's eating... Ew, the limbs. I think my back seized up. My hip. Maybe my knee. He got stuck in the window trying to escape. <laughs> Okay, at least he fixed his back. Did he just steal a person's apple? Turn you mute. Don't be stealing shit. This is not the East End of London. This is Australia, where we're not pickpocketers. And her doctor going to stop her. Uh. The Lord provides. The old man gotta shut up before he gets them in trouble. <laughs> Until he was tragically kicked. Repeatedly in the head by an angry- I feel like if someone is coming to my house as a doctor and then one of the doctors was like, yeah, this doctor was kicked in the head a bunch of times. So he's a little, ooh, I'd, I would be a little suspicious and scared about him being there and treating somebody. So I don't know if that's necessarily the right thing to do, but- Had half his brain surgically removed. It might help. There's my former teacher. Oh. I hear a beating can be quite nourishing for the imbecile. Uh, <laughs> uh, no. <laughs> wow. Well. Never mind, it worked in his favor because now they're just looking at him as like a sad being or whatever. Used to be creeping upwards. What? That made me so uncomfortable. Was she just trying to seduce him? That woman in there is Captain Gaines's wife. <gasps> She's a cheater. His hobby is people twice. <laughs> so not only does he people, but his wife's out here cheating. Well, trying to cheat, which is just as bad as cheating. <laughs> That's sad. The convict servant or the escaped convict master. So is that, wait, 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 is he saying, oh, let's just steal a bunch because who cares because I'll take the blame because I'm the servant? I feel like that still will get you guys in trouble. Dr. Le Goff from Paris. He said no more voices, stop. What would the governor think? Sounds like you're just sick and that man is stealing again. You see, when it comes to dispute and the French medics, they like to smell and then taste. That's disgusting. That is so disgusting. No, no, absolutely not. Ew, ew. Stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it. That's, uh, that's so disgusting. That's so, I literally got chills. That's so disgusting. Explique cela, s'il vous plaît. <laughs> Damn, that's some really good French right there. It's a pretty necklace. Do not try stealing it, dog. Let it go. I feel like you have a chance to start over. Why are you continuing your tendencies of pickpocketing? All he wants is that necklace. Do you like dancing? No. <laughs> what about you? Chemistry. I like her. She's interested in interesting stuff. Poetry. Yes. Yes. I don't like poetry. <laughs> Did I just run over a kid? You ran over a child? Why were you looking where you were going? <laughs> Is his leg like stuck under the wheel or something? Is that why they can't move? Put a tourniquet on this. No, it's not tight enough. Well, I'm happy that they're finally meeting because I feel like this is going to be something. What about Burgess procedure? He would die of shock and pain. Not if you take the pain with ether. Girl, but listen, if she is giving you like facts as to why it works, maybe listen to her. I feel like she seems to know what she's talking about. Like, the thing is, he knows what he's talking about too, but you might as well try what she's talking about. That is unproven. Look, I understand that it's unproven, but... One of us is a qualified surgeon. That isn't fair because the amount of research she does, I think she she should be a qualified surgeon. She just has to go through training, of course. Oh, would you like a lift? So, okay, so they're giving this boy a lift. But I feel bad because she has an idea to save his leg. Excuse me? Oh, they left this guy behind. <laughs> Oh, don't care. If she knows what she's talking about and she's like, you know what, let's try and save the leg, give her an opportunity. Just give her an opportunity to speak about what she knows. Maybe you could be incited to more information, you know? But I feel like he's just gonna shut her down and cut off his leg. And it's... this is so much more interesting than I thought it would be. I'm like getting really into this. Holy crap, I'm, I'm excited. I sure gonna have a terrific scar. I don't think the boy wants a scar. Because the biggest risk to any surgeon is the addiction to feeling like God. I mean, that is true, but if you have the option for it not to be painful, try it out. Might I suggest you find your spine? Oh, what a way. What a way to tell someone to shove it, suck it. <laughs> Oh, I love this girl. She's funny. Are they going to her house where she has like more control and could possibly save his leg and prove him wrong? Bring here, you ridiculous woman. This is the governor's residence. Her house. And the governor's daughter. That is a nice house. I need surgical equipment. I've got it. Why? I love how she's like, yeah, I've got supplies. Don't worry. And he's like, why? Why do you have supplies? In just a few minutes, 
I can't imagine how heavy some of these dresses are. Oh. Spilt my fizz. Oh, she really got her supplies going. She knows what she's doing. She's ready and she's prepared. She's ready and she's prepared is the same thing. So I don't know what I just said. <laughs> it's just different ways of saying it. <laughs> Wait, does she have a problem with like her heart, her heart or her breathing or something? Ether. Okay, she has ether. Snatch the rubies. Happy days. Stop trying to get him to pickpocket again. He's finally trying to start over and being a surgeon. Although he does hurt, he does owe a lot of money, which I'm not sure how he's gonna pay back. You know, the last time I stole something was 15 years ago. I'm so proud of you. This is who I am. Yeah, I don't think you should be pushing him to be a crook again. Like he changed his ways. He's being a better person. Although he owes a lot of money now, <laughs> so it's like. Mm. What do you plan to do for work without your hand? Yeah, I feel like it's gonna be this weird thing if he doesn't have a choice. It's like, okay, yeah, you wanna be, you wanna continue being the surgeon, but you owe 26 pounds or whatever it is, and you're gonna lose one of your hands if you don't pay it. One last time. See? Because if he doesn't, he's gonna lose his hand. Okay, no, there's no time. We're gonna have to do it here. It's like in, right in the middle of our house, they're just doing this to this poor kid. Well, <laughs> is she gonna get in trouble for this? <laughs> oh my God, they're in the middle of doing a tour. A very special treat for you. Oh, there it's gonna be an audience? Oh my god, she's saying that he's gonna be performing an operation that's never been done before. Theria, cowardly surgeon, might just simply remove the leg. Dr. Dawkins will make a thousand- She's basically saying, now you gotta do it because you're gonna be looked at as a coward if you don't. <laughs> I mean, kind of smart. Don't you? Oh, it's the girl in her necklace. Please don't steal her necklace. Not if I can do it. Ooh, this is gonna get you both in so much trouble and it's gonna be so messy. But I understand why they feel like they don't like have a choice here. I don't know. I feel like what if people watch him do the surgery and they're like, oh wow, he's an amazing surgeon. He's the first person to do this. And then he ends up getting more money from that. Like, I feel like there's better ways to go about it than going back to being a crook, right? Shut up and eat. the patient. Ether the patient, bro. I feel like this is gonna work. As Dr. Dawkins anesthetizes the boy. Let's go. I mean, it's weird as hell that they're using this as entertainment, but for its time, I guess it makes sense. He's, okay, he's drilling into his bone and now she grabbed some pliers. <laughs> that was a weird shot, didn't like that. Okay, he squished the bones back together and he's trying to steal the necklace in the process. There's a lot going on at once. Okay, he stacked the bones back together with like a metal thingy and now he's sewing the kid back up and he officially saved the leg, huh? And she's looking at him in awe. She's like, what did I tell you? You saved the leg. Can we rouse him from living death? Now comes the waking him up. Charlie. Come on, Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. You've got a Chocolate Factory to win. Win? Enter? Own? <laughs> I have no doubt he's gonna wake up. Don't cut me, Charlie. I knew it! The Yankee Dodge! Damn, he stole that quick. That was wonderful, Dodge. My, my rubies have been stolen. Y'all thought that they wouldn't notice? You really thought that she wouldn't have noticed her beautiful necklace on her? Oh, what's happening to her? Oh, you all right? <gasps> oh my God, is he gonna find the necklace? Wait, where, where's the necklace? It was in his pocket. Unless he managed to take it out in time before he searched him. Unless she knew? I'm so curious now. And has he ever examined you? I guess she's scared to get it wrong. Wait, but what's wrong with her? I need to listen to your back. Take off your dress. There has to be something wrong in her chest, right? Okay, thank you for looking away while she was undressing. I was like, is he just gonna stare at her? And now. What's wrong with her? Is this something serious or is she okay? You're a common thief. She has the necklace. But why did she protect him? Darius cheated me at cards. He's gonna take one of my hands if I don't pay him a ludicrous debt. Yeah, he doesn't have a lot of money. Ooh, is she gonna be understanding or is this gonna be... Make me the first female surgeon and I keep your secret. She's smart! She is smart! She's gonna get what she wants! Do it, come on. I mean, otherwise you're gonna... So I don't think you have much of a choice here. But she's smart, do it! I'm thinking. You don't have much time to think, do you now? <laughs> that was thoroughly good. I really enjoyed it. I wonder what you guys are thinking about this show. I think I'm gonna continue it. This is this this is really interesting. I'm liking it. I love the vibes. I love Thomas Rody Sangster, is that his name? And I love Maya Mitchell. This is like the cast is awesome. I love it. I really like the story, the fact that he used to be a pickpocketer and now he's a surgeon. He changed his life around, but now he owes a bunch of money because a guy cheated in cards, so now he owes a lot of money, so he doesn't really have a choice. And she wanted to become the first female surgeon, but she didn't know how, and now she found a way to become it's like it's really 
cool. I like this. I am honestly excited to continue it. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this with me. Do not forget to subscribe because remember we are on that goal of 200,000 subscribers and give this video a like while you're at it. But I will see you guys in the next one. See ya.